Hi there and welcome back to Champions of Kryn. I am Byron. And we just saw Mertani at the end of the last video, but he got away, that sneaky bastard. And he had a dragon lance. Shit. Oh, hi. More stairs. Mertani laughs at you from the top of the circular staircase. He carries the dragon lance. His troops salute him with a guttural growl as he turns to leave. They attack. Alrighty, what do we have here? That's not too spectacular, is it? No, it is not. Um, well, you could just attack. Brackel loses the weapon. Shit. Balls. You would yell. Oh, there's another one up there. Yeah, 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 yeah. Nobody likes you. So, well, what could you do? You could move up here. And cast... no, that was not cast. That is cast. Stinking Cloud. Why not? Here. Buzz is unaffected. Boo! You could also... well... I think you could cast the Stinking Cloud. You can. <coughs> Jokes and gags. Unaffected. <coughs> so, well, you are helpless. You are dead. Good night. <coughs> Missed. Ow. Oh. What are you doing? Well, we could help with a few magic missiles, can we? Everybody loses the weapon. Yeah, Rackle. It sucks. Ah, well, take the other long sword then. Good night. Chucks and gags. You're stupid, you shouldn't have gone in there. Now you die. And you're dead too. So, what do we get? 65 steel coins. No, I don't, really don't wish to go up. I wish to get in here. And um, now you have a 1d8 plus 3, that means we should give you that other longsword again. 1d8 plus 4.
we fix and get our magic bag <sighs> why Thanks. Oh, really? Yeah, lick your sword. I hope it's poisoned. Or maybe you lick it to poison it. What would happen if you bit your own tongue? Oh, for crying out loud. You know what? N yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Stinking cloud. Cast another stinking cloud, another stinking cloud, another stinking cloud. Oh, unaffected. How unpleasant. No, for fuck's sake. Oh, you. Oh, of course. There's an asset pool. You can't go there. Why do you always lose your weapon rackle? Get a decent grip on it. Now you could yell. The point is, um, ah, oh shit. View item. Now you have a magical sword and you can't seem to keep it. The point is, if you yell and you face a really large amount of monsters, they always want to kill the person that yells, the candle that insults them, and that might actually end up uh, in uh, distributing the enemies quite widely instead of having them grouped close together. So if you fight in an open space, you might want to get your fighters in the way between the enemies and the well, the weaker party members, mages and thieves like that. But if your thief, uh, your candor, uh, that in most times will be one of the weaker party members, yells, the enemies might actually try to um, circumvent your fighters to get to the thief. And that would suck. Fuck. I don't care. Cast magic missile. Finish him off. Oh, 
Fuck, I hate you. I don't care. Good night. Yeah, yeah. We leave. What do we get? 50 more steel coins. And you get your magical longsword back. Thank you. Um, spells? No. Hey, a fireball. And a stinking cloud. Nothing for you. Apparently I'm not able to leave this area because I always have to retreat and get my spells back. Three civilization six. That would be four. Well, but sooner or later I will exhaust the random encounters in this area and then we will move on. Yeah, this time I go up. Why not? You see circular stairs going up and down. What do you do? That apparently is the seventh floor. Um. I have no idea. Let's stay. Stay. So I'm facing south to the north is that okay. There are two doors, one leads to the west and one to the east. Okay, there's another set of stairs. There's another set of stairs. Oh well. We use those. If we can go up here, we can do that. We will do that. Um, that would be the eighth story. We go up. Kepak rush you from the stairs above. You hear Matani yelling something and attack. Sort of. <laughs> okay. Fine. You delay a bit, you yell, because they won't be able to circumvent the party. There are just five of them. They won't be able to get past my fighters. You delay. Delay. You cast a stinking cloud. And target it in here. I fucking hate you. You know what? And target it in here. You cast a stinking cloud and probably can only target it here, right? But we try. Doesn't work. I hate you. So, how about this layer? Hmm. Fine. You switch to the short bow. That works nicely. Did you yell? Yeah, I think you did. Good night. Mm -hmm. I 
I like how the bow works. I don't like how the sword works, but hey. Good night. Can you still get him? Yes, you can. Nice. So, how about we attack you? Hmm. Doesn't seem to do too much. Okay. Quit. That's not much. What do you do? You stay, you encamp, and you fix. And save. We go up. Mirtani is ordering his followers to hold you back. He runs up the stairs while Draconians turn and attack. That is getting old. <sighs> Fine. <sighs> well, you delay a bit. You delay? Oh, wrong button. You cause the stinking cloud. And try to place it here. It works, yay! That's nice. Did you yell? Yes, you did. You're stupid if you go in there. And now you're dead. Oh, really? Yeah... I don't care. Good night. Quit, quit, quit. That was not too difficult, was it? We encamp, we fix. Do you have the proper long sword? Yes, you have it.
Oh, I, I actually I don't see them, but hey, okay. I go up. You are at the top of the tower. Mitani has climbed on the back of a large red dragon. He carries the dragon lance in triumph. triumph. Large black shapes drift down from above. Mitani orders them to attack. Oops. Mitani escapes. Black dragons swoop down upon you. A battle begins. That's not nice. Um. Oh shit. 24 hit points and uh, they have hmm, only an armor class of 3. You delay a bit. Let's get it out of you. Can you yell at them? Yeah, you can. It only seems to work on two. But it's cool. Um, prayer. Well, what could we do? I think you move down here. Nah. Let's see. You cast... Oh. You don't have a... Huh, that sucks. I wanted to cast a cloud spell, but apparently that's not possible. Do you have a one? You have still have a stinking cloud, okay? So you cast that here. Chokes and gags. So that's a cuff. Oh, I hate you. Well, if you are helpless, you are dead. So a fireball clearly is out of the question in here. So use a magic missile. Um, you cast the black charm person. That is stupid. I didn't want to use it. Dang it! Aim. What do you have? can't do much right now. You have to delay. You have to delay. You could move a bit out of harm's way and cast a magic missile on him. Ow. 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 You can't do much. You. Hmm. <sighs> you can't get in. Your hands are full. Yeah. So you use your sling. You move down and cast a magic missile on the evil dragon. Good riddance! We are victorious! Who would have thought? Uh, 782 experience points. What do we get? Six gems. And that's it. Conquer relations. The party gains experience. You see circular stairs going down. Do you wish to go down? Yeah, I guess. So, no dragon lands for us. Uh... 
uh, we stay we encamp we fix we fix and save and we should get our spells back rest okay so no dragon lands in gargath keep for us we go down we go down we go down we go down no. Okay, so we are back at the uh, what's his face level six, if I'm not totally wrong. So I don't want to go up. I want to go down. And now we are on the third level, if I'm not wrong. We have to leave the keep again. Don't really know. Well, where the stairs here? No. Then they were probably here. Yes. Oh, really? We just fought three black dragons and you want to mess with us. Fine. Snake charm. Nice, right? Great, you're so good. Not with that weapon. Oops. She still has her staff sling. That's how you do it, Randy. That's how you do it. Kill the snake.
Thanks. Um, where was I? Okay, and done. So now we are, where are we? On the first level, I think. Uh, why did I do that? D, not F. So, we should leave the keep. Since we didn't get what we were looking for. And I think the secret exit was here. Yes. No, I don't want to enter. Let's return to the outpost. We have disturbing news. Evil forces have discovered the tomb of Sir Dargard. He relates the legend and you record it in journal entry 18. Tale of Sir Dargard. In the past, a faithful knight of the Rose named Sir Dargard gained an item which gave him great fighting prowess. He was a scourge of the evil armies until his entire company was poisoned at defeat. The company was buried along with Sir Dargard's great device in the lands later overrun by evil. The evil ones sought to wrest the artifact from the tomb but were slain by the spirits of Sir Dargard and his company. Our scouts now say that draconians have attempted to penetrate the tomb began perhaps with sufficient strength to succeed. It is time for a truly noble knight to go and ask that the artifact be passed on to guard the forces of good today. On a side note, um, you will be happy to know that Caraman has contacted our elite units in Salamnia. The Council of Knights themselves will lead them into the coming battles. I will be certain to mention your impressive record to them when they arrive and we get a map. The tomb apparently is to the north west of this outpost. Okay. Yeah, the tomb is to the northwest. Good luck. So we pull our money. You have this nice long sword. What does it do? A long sword plus four versus reptiles. That's not half bad. So we sell that. And yeah, we could. Yeah, we could call it a video, I think. We will continue the next one. I will try and see whether I can level up a few party members, and we'll see each other in the next video. So thank you very much for watching and see you soon.